There is really nothing like this in the world. It brings together uh, technology from known beverage practices, but applies it to something completely new, to distilled cannabis. This is a 150,000 square foot facility dedicated strictly to our beverage production. And it takes about 14 people to operate, which is quite incredible. But of course, there's you know upwards of 50 people who support it through the engineering team and the quality assurance. The starting point is our own intellectual property that lets us create a beverage that you know really um, has an onset, an intensity, a duration that is very similar to beverage alcohol with the right dosing. You know, like you can have one beer, you can have one glass of wine, you can have one drink of cannabis and still be able to interact with your coworkers, play with your children. It's not it's not um, the stereotypical, you know, smoke a joint and it's like having six shots of tequila, right? So our chocolates, which we'll talk about, um, actually has a longer onset. So it is, you know, particularly the, the formulation, the intellectual property that goes into it that allows our beverages to have a faster onset. This is an exciting proposition. We have a product that we can, you know, replicate the beverage alcohol experience in terms of you know onset, duration, intensity. We can give a good experience, it's social to, you know, similar to a social experience that you know, and we can deliver it with no hangover, with no calories, and we can make it taste great and put a great brand on it. So I think this is, particularly for you know uh, consumers who have been curious and looking at Canvas, this is a really good entry point for them to have a reliable, consistent, you know, safe entry experience into Canvas. So, uh, you know, it's a major investment that we've made because we believe in uh, in this product. We think it's going to be very exciting for Canadians and we want to make sure we have the supply when uh, when they need it. Okay. And as of October 17th, you had to put the 60-day notice in. Correct. Many of us did expect it would be a little earlier, but you know, this is, uh, you know, this is the, the rules that they've set. So, you know, for us, we're just, you know, working towards that, which means, you know, our notifications are in. You can see the facilities are are ready. And, you know, for us, it's about getting all these products out to market, uh, you know, in advance of Christmas.